Alright, and welcome to the semi-finals. I am here, dual casting with... Orchidaceous. Something like that. And anyways, we've got... So, our, my, my game's kind of frozen right now. Oh, it's nothing exciting. Uh okay. Oh great, we're starting a... There we go. <laughs> We're starting a StarCraft 2 conversation. Oh, good, good. Haha, <laughs> that died really quick. <laughs> and looks like it looks like um, they're both going for the same see, build. Like, well, uh, I already called Matisse's build straight off the bat. Pretty sure you could probably see it queued already. Yep, exactly. It's Mac Energy Generator. Um, storage, two mechs, and then like a factory. Yeah, it looks like that yeah. there's just a slight variation to Orbnet's game. He's doing almost the same thing. He's Instead he of bought. going for the extra mechs, he's going for the extra power generator. Yeah, and he's he's already got the bot factory queued up. Yeah, both of them do, so Whereas, this is going to be a close game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Or slightly faster on the bot factory, but ah, uh, you know, it's a neck they're, and neck race even... right now. Yeah, I think Orb will win. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't even realize that. Jeez. Oh, like bot oh, factory no. race. I actually can't call it. It's because it looks close. exactly. Yeah, I don't think that was that was way too hard to call. Yeah, but it doesn't really matter as long as how they expand is really important because there's a lot of nice mechs all around, especially in the water. There's quite a few yeah. points there. Um, let's see, if if you look around, um, the main problem is uh, Orb kind of can expand really close to him. I mean, look at all the mechs that he has right beside him. Whereas with Matiz, look look how long of a walk he has before he can get to a cluster. Yep, he does have a little bit of a long walk, but he has a really nice access to a huge amount of mechs. For um, Orb, it's pretty much he has the ones close by, then he has to go all the way around the water before he can get to a nice cluster, and then he also has to deal with all the mountains to traverse. So when it comes down yeah. to it, it's pretty even still, I would say. It really depends on who goes for what first. Yeah, yeah. And it looks like Orb's well, it looks already like, on a yep. air factory. Uh, air. He's going to start scouting Matiz, early here. Um, he he really. Can't join your channel. Uh, hold on. It looks like one of his builders was doing a little happy dance there for yeah, a moment. Yeah, it looks to me like Matiz is really um really really slow on the air factory, from what I can tell. Yeah, which may give him a disadvantage. Especially with this close. If they were farther away, he'd have time, but with them being this close, it may be game over for him. But he's already working on that tech, too. And 3 minutes 30 to 40 seconds, so it's actually slightly faster than he usually goes for it. So let's see how it treats him. Yep, he might be able to do it. And he's got docks out to go ahead and start going around and trying to kill off any expansions, but it looks like. Orb also has some doxes out running interference. Yeah. And he's getting a bomber also, so this could be close. And yes. it looks like Orb's yeah, scouting, like scouting him. Scouting him, and he's already working on that tech too. And three minutes. Uh, one moment. Uh, one moment. Seconds, so it's actually slightly different than usually for those for it. So let's see how it treats Yep. Just stop with new pass left your channel. Okay. There we. There we go. There we go. All right. Okay. Um. Yeah. All better now. So looks like Orb just scouted him. Um. Can see that he's building a tech two. I think he might try to get that bomber in to break the tier two. He might. I don't um, know if it... Especially. Well, since he has no anti-air at all, it'll be really easy to send in the bombers. Yeah. Um. But it looks like more. He's more so. He's focusing on his expansion. Yep. The, uh, one of the games, it was actually really, really close. Um, pretty much uh, 
Matiz just started building his advanced bot factory, and there was like three scouts right beside it. So if those scouts were like microed properly, they would have killed the uh, bot factory. Oh, he's going actually so for the it's... engineers. If he can kill off yeah, those engineers, I then that. he'll get that. And that's the really big problem with not having any air defense whatsoever. There's just, just nothing your you can do. Engineers just get picked off. Yeah. Uh, but it looks like he's got just... an anti-air bot. We'll see how that does. It's not doing too well so far. And looks it looks like, like he's, he's going to get an anti-air tower. Um, yeah. He's about halfway finished his uh, advanced bot factory, so... Anti-air bots, their work. Killed off one bomber. Two. A second. Three. Nope. Going for another one. Yeah. And there's three, four. four. And then... And it looks like dead. that's it. Yep. And it actually looks like yeah. that and orb's going to bring his comm forwards. Well, interesting, interesting. Matiz's comm is already quite ahead. So we'll see how that goes. Oh, it may turn into a comm fight. The uh, the first the first fight against uh, Matiz and Evans turned into a comm fight, and um, they both died because of the explosion from the comm afterwards. Yep, we'll see though, because so... there comes that comm, and he is pushing in. Oh yeah, he's doing he's doing his work. All right, it looks like he's rushing slammers. So we'll see uh, how yeah. those do. Yeah, they're they are really powerful. He does that pretty much every game. Rush like at least one or two slammers, depending on the situation. Looks like he's gonna have to go for more slammers than he normally does, because he usually goes for an advanced fabricator after after the first uh, slammer. Yep, he's really pushing everything see, on it. Just, yeah, he just relocated a bunch of engineers just so he can get more slammers out faster. I yep. think. Yeah, he has to stop that advancement with the comms and uh, all the pounders, or else it's really, it's really going to hit him hard. And looks like that orb just lost a bomber because it was just sitting there, hmm. which was kind of a sad sight to see. And the comms coming in, yeah. and the slammers are bombers being are coming in. pulled back, not going into the fight. He's going to want to bring that comm in. Oh, and he may be able to take out the other comm. Uh, if he yeah. can use those slammers correctly. The other comms about at half health. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna try to rush those slammers in. Oh, the slammers are coming in, and they may be able to take out that comm. That comm. Let's see how this goes. This this might be GG here if they keep hitting him really hard. Yeah. Oh, looks like he might survive just because he's going to reach his pounder line. But that was a close call for Orb. Ridiculously be... close. I think. It looks like um, Matez is just going to keep following him all the way Oh yeah, he's pushing it. Base almost. He, uh, he you'll want to be careful this. though. If he outer extends too far, he may lose those engineers. His, uh, engineers to those pounders, which would be a really bad loss. Yeah. But yeah, he's really pushing in and lots of slammers coming out. But they're being caught up. He really up. could have used some airs there too, actually. If he had some nice bombers going, they would have, they would have definitely been a, a nice addition to all of that. Yep, definitely. And the comms getting some fire again. Are you are you noticing the little the little wave of pounders that are trying to surround the comm almost? Matisse's yep. comm that is. But the slimers are coming in and they're just taking out the pounders there, trying to stop. Oh yeah. If and only it looks had some. Like he might just turn this. Oh, look at all those bombers. Let's see what the. And they went for those engineers. engineers and it'd be a great idea for him to pull back right now because he can't fight the comm straight up. He's taking shots from a turret, and he needs to pull his comp out now if he's going to. It looks like he's fight. just going to try to bring his slammers forward and see if he can push it. Oh, he's trying to really kill the comp, and it, it might turn into a tie. Like if, oh. if he kills the comp and the comp explosion kills him, oh, it looks like he might pull back, or is he going? He forward? is pulling right, back. He pulling really back. needs to pull those slammers in, though. Those slammers have yeah. to cover his escape, and he really needs some air bombers. defense. Yeah. Because those bombers could potentially kill his con. He's working on one air factory and a second advanced bot factory, but he definitely needs to take care of those um, those bombers. Now, right now they're not doing too much, and he took down another one. 
so it shouldn't be too hard. He's mm. bringing in some anti-air and, and a combat and Yep. It and it's repairing like his comp. To kill the final. He's got yep. the anti-air coming towards him. Slammers coming around the side of Orb's base. I'm. I think they might. They try. They're going to try to kill that vehicle factor. Although they might just continue forward. Nope. They're going to go ahead and run around the side, but without any air cover, they're pretty big targets. Oh yeah. One slammer down. Looks like the second one. Nope. And yeah, there's one left. The second one. And he might and... kill that factory, and it's down, and it's gone. Right. He he managed to get two mechs and one tower from that. What was yep. what four slammers? As you can see, if you take a quick look near the south pole, he's moving another slammer force towards um, one of uh, Orb's expansions. He's yep. already got one mech down, two. Yep, and he's chasing it. It looks like that. No idea. Orbs just figured out what's going on down there, and he's trying to pull yeah. that fabricator back. Engineer. Yeah. If he can keep that fabrication bot alive, that'd be great for him, because then he can just move back the moment the slammers are out of the, out of there. Yep. I'm he's actually about interested. Halfway finished. Yeah, Pardon? he's almost done there. I've, I'll be interested to see if he uh, sees about trying to get some sniper bots out. We haven't really seen any of those in games today. Yeah, um, I think they might have been in Merit's game because Merit was just talking about them saying they were really, like, really ridiculously strong, so who knows. Although, I think he'll just stick towards Slammers. He really likes them. So far, every game he's used them, but he really needs to get some anti air, and that fighter just came in and killed those two bombers that were yep. attacking his. Uh, Great timing, and actually, if he gets any closer, he may be able to take down this bomber before it can take off, and it's gone! He just took out a bomber oh, before it could rise up, which was actually a great thing to do. Mm -hmm. um, he's about almost three quarters of the way finished his second tier two bot factory. So let's see, yep. uh, I think that'll be a nice improvement. I, I think what he's going to try to do from there is get at least one advanced fabricator unit out from there and then start working on some more slammers. Up, uh, I see a comm coming for Orb. He's trying to push his comm forwards. With we'll that if he... giant pounder army, that's gonna look like it's, he's just gonna put his comm in the middle of it. Yep. Do you see the, the slammer force though coming in from the side? Yep, I see that coming in from both sides actually. And he's just, just going to reap, rip up the base. One vehicle factory. And, oh right, it looks like that. He was able to that see it in time, and he's pulling back his crew. Damage. Let's see where he's going. And that base is being ripped apart. Oh, oh yeah. And don't forget, it's now coming in from behind too, but I don't think he's going to be able to get the pounders there fast enough before they do their damage. Yep, they're ripping through he's things. He's already killed one factory and, it, and uh, a tower. I think he's going to try to go for a second factory. I'm not too certain, though. Oh, and look at the calm rush that's coming. Yep, and he's With got some units to defend. Pounder force. Yep, he really needs those to move really those slammers in on the side. And the slammers are hitting hard. The, and that calm's he, he losing health. Oh, and an and uber died. cannon. Oh, oh. The calm oh. just died, and, Matiz, and he takes him. Matiz is slightly alive. Matiz just won. An orb is taken down. And that is it. Matiz moves on. Matiz almost died. Look how look how little health he has. If he got hit maybe one more time, I think it would have been a draw. Possibly, but Matiz that takes was... down Orb, and he moves and on wins. to the final rounds.